can we get pretty good wood on that one. Do I throw it again? Do I throw the split? High in the air and catchable. Blanco. It's a no hitter for Tim Lincecum. <laughs> The third man in baseball history to have 4,000 hits. He does it in the first inning, and the Yankees come out of the dugout to congratulate him for a great achievement. In Japanese, David, they would say, Omadeto, which is congratulations. Getting closer to first pitch from Detroit, it's Tigers baseball, and it starts right now. First opened in the millennium year of 2000. There's a look at Comerica Park here in Detroit. Tonight we've got a good matchup in store between the San Diego Padres and the Detroit Tigers. Matt Vaskersian with you for another edition of Tigers Baseball here on the show. I'll be joined in the booth shortly by longtime big leaguers Eric Karros and Steve Lyons. But first, let's get a look at the starting lineup for the visiting San Diego Padres as their manager Bud Black will align his order like this. And getting his final warm-up tosses in, there you see the numbers for one of the very best starters in the game, all-star right-hander Justin Verlander. with Cabrera will take his cuts now. The 2-1. And he fires a fastball now for a called strike two. Mm, a little conviction behind that fastball. And he takes strike three called on the fastball. Then the leadoff man is gone to start the evening. So Verlander takes care of the leadoff man here. And with that, let's take a look at the defense for the Detroit Tigers. It's brought to us by Majestic. So the bases are empty with one man gone. And standing in now, the left-handed hitting Will Venable. And he just manages to stay alive here as he fights this one foul. And this ball is also hit foul and heading for the seat, so we'll have to do it again. Still two and two. No offer on that one, and Verlander's run at full down, three and two. Wow, what an at bat he's having right now. He's fought off some tough pitches. He's laid off a few pitches like that one, and now he's worked his way back to a three and two count. Jackson is there, two gone. You know, that's the thing with throwing a fastball as hard as he does. It makes fly balls travel that much farther off the bat. This thing gets out there a long ways before it finally gets tracked down. 2-1 pitch is that circle change swung on and missed 2-2. Two two. Top of the first just underway here in Motown. And he struck him out. Three up, three down against Verlander here in the first. The Tigers coming up, no score. Here's a look at the starting lineup for the Tigers now. They match up against a guy looking to put his injury woes from the past few years behind him, veteran right-hander Ian Kennedy. The 
Defensively, the pod range alignment will look like this. Here's Ian Kinsler now. Kinsler, of course, had spent his entire professional career in the Rangers organization, drafted by them in 2003, but now he makes the move north to join the Tigers ball club. And I think there will be a, a little bit of a transition period. That's kind of natural. But once he settles in, he's going to realize that, hey, he's got a good shot to win a World Series with the club that they've put together here in Detroit. And I think he's going to fit in just fine. Now a swing, and he popped him up. And no ordinary pop-up at that. This is way up there. Corey Hunter will stand in. He took home a Silver Slugger Award for American League outfielders a year ago. Now a swing by Hunter as he rolls over one and sends it out to shortstop. Throw to first, retires Hunter, and that's the second out of the inning. Miguel Cabrera will get his first cuts now, and he'll do so with the bases empty and two away here in the first. Now a ball hit foul down the line in right and in amongst the fans. Good battle here. This will be the seventh pitch coming up. Swing and a ball hard hit toward deep right. And some trouble now in right field. First base runner of the ball game now for either team. Comes with two outs here in the home first. Now with the cleanup guy do next, things all of a sudden could get a bit interesting. And he chased one there as this is bounced to short. Throw on to second for the force, and the side is retired. Tigers come up empty in the first. We... Carlos Quinton leads things off now in the top half of the second. And this is swung on and missed, so they're able to get Quinton here for the first down. And he was really late on this one. I mean, really late. You can see where the baseball is by the time he gets the barrel through. I mean, it's darn near in the catcher's glove already. That tells me he was probably looking for something else. And he That's lost him here on 3-2 as that pitch misses. It's ball four. Yonder Alonso will get his first shot here with the runner at first now and one away. And this is fouled back and out of play. Goes down and gets it as this is bounced to short. Kinsler for one. On to Cabrera, but it's too late, and they'll just get the one. Jet Jerko will get his first cuts here with two gone now and a runner at first. Now a swing and a hard hit ball to short. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. We'll get a look at Austin Jackson when we come back. We'll go to the bottom of the second, no score. And so here is Austin Jackson. He'll look to get something going here in this scoreless ball game. And now this ball's lifted in the air down the right field line, but this will get back into the seats, so the count holds at two and two. And this is swung on and sent on the ground to first. Alonzo will step on the bag himself for the out. Rajay Davis will get his first cuts here. Now the payoff pitch home. Here's a bouncing ball now up the middle, and it's going to sneak its way into center field for a one-out base hit. A good job there of making a two-strike adjustment. Very compact there. He uses the middle of the field. And this just finds its way into center for a base hit. And there goes Davis. Ball swung on and hit high down the line in left, but it'll get back in among the crowd, so the count holds it 0-2. Runner going a second time. Reaches down and hits this one on the ground to short. 
throw on to first, two gone. Yeah, and here with the runner who's on the move, you've got no chance of even thinking about getting the double play. So a smart idea there just to take the sure out at first. Here's a ground ball to first. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. One left for Detroit. We'll move to the third with no score. Cameron Mabin is ready to go here as we begin the third. Now a ball fouled down the right field line out of play, so that'll move the count to two and two now. Picks up another one, make it four strikeouts already, and there's the first out. One out now in the San Diego third, and that'll bring in the right-handed hitting catcher, Nick Hundley. And he just does manage to fight this one off as it's fouled away. And the payoff pitch is chopped foul at home plate, so we'll do it again. Still three and two. the battle as this is swung on and missed for the second out. And sometimes it doesn't quite matter how hard a thrower a guy is. If he can locate, he's going to be successful. The location here is absolutely spot on. Right on the inside corner. That's a tough, tough pitch. Now the 2-1. And a swing and a bouncing ball back up the middle. And the throw just does beat him at the bag, so the side is retired. Nothing doing against Verlander that time around. It remains. Jose Iglesias makes his way to the plate to get us started here in the bottom of inning number three. And he just gets a piece there as this is chopped foul. Hit hard to second. A quick out number one. Oh, man, you can't hit a ball any harder than that. I mean, this ball gets on him in a heartbeat, maybe even a half heartbeat, considering how fast his heart is beating right now. But he's on it all the way, and he winds up making the play. Now here's his swing, and a ball hit well out there toward right center. Mabin is there as he had to travel a ways, but he makes the catch deep in the alley for the second out. Corey Hunter will stand in. He grounded out his first time. Here's the 3-2 pitch. Hit hard back up the middle, and that'll get down for a two-out single. Yeah, that's a two-out hit here in the third inning. Maybe just a little something to get this guy out of his early comfort zone and put him into the stretch. Miguel Cabrera will get a shot here with two away and a runner at first now following the base hit. That two-out single seemed harmless enough, but any time you extend the inning to allow this guy to get a shot with a runner on, you better be careful. The relay, and he is safe at second base as he legs out a double. Victor Martinez will try and cash in on this two-out rally as he's got a couple of men in scoring position with two away. 3-2, here it comes. Fouled back. And a pitch down that swung on and sent to second base. Throw on to first, and the Tigers wind up with nothing as the inning is over. A golden opportunity to get on the board. Here goes for naught. Three innings in the books. Still no score on the show.